All right, guys, quickly before we get into today's video, I gotta give a huge shout out to Legendary Game of Heroes for sponsoring your boy. Now, some of you guys might recognize this app because I've done a promo for them before, and it's been a while, but I'm, I'm still playing the game, and if you guys aren't familiar with the first promo, instead of me trying to explain you how the game works, let me just show you. So as you guys can see, I'm pretty far along in the main campaign, but I'm gonna show you guys how this game works. This is my team right here. We're gonna get right into the battle. But basically, what you're gonna wanna do is put the gems in power of three or more that's gonna power up your team so that you can slap up your opponent and get the W and boom just like that your boy wins slapped up the boss let's see what we get all right we got three stars we slapped it pretty quick player rank and we get a bunch of cards just like that but that isn't the only way you can get cards. As you guys know, if you're an OG subscriber, I love opening packs and on Legendary Gaming Heroes, you can open some packs as well. So I'm gonna go ahead and open a premium hero pack and see what we get. All right, this is a big one. Let's see what we get. Come on, come on, come on. Three star, Vabs, Vabs, oh! Oh, 500 gems. We basically paid off the pack right there. Oh, I don't know. What, oh my god. What is that? We got a six star master rune big vaps So just like that you can add to your team But that's not the only thing you can also play with your friends, which is obviously a big vibe So when you guys download the app be sure to join my guild It's called the it's your guild as you guys can see right now. It's just me I'm all by my lonely so please join up and we can play some games together If you guys want to download the app the link is at the top of the description Like I said be sure to get it Add your boy up and let's play some games together. And let's get right into the video. Hey yo, what's up ladies and gentlemen? It's your boy and welcome back to another video. Now you're probably wondering why I'm in this small room, which some of you might recognize as David's troll room when we first moved into the house. All right, come in. Have you ever had a dream that, 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 you, you, you oh. no, 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 no. What is this? <laughs> Paw Patrol! <laughs> I got you a TV, a garbage, <laughs> and I drew a giant sriracha bottle for you that, on that, the top. That. Welcome home. Welcome like home. That. And that's because today we are going to be eating only prison foods for 24 hours. And as you guys know, I don't have fast things, okay? So I'm also going to be locking myself. You just shut up and put that on, you peasant! It's a blanket. Yeah, it's black and white like your prison outfit. Take my hat off, you're gonna stretch it. That's my, that's my Shut thing. up! Shut up, you're a prisoner. You, uh, you're my rules. So tell your subscribers right now to subscribe to Ryan Swayze. Subscribe to Ryan Swayze, please. That's what I like to hear. I'm a prisoner and I'm eating. Prisoner. Continue your intro. I'm, I'm trying. Can tell, tell them what to okay. do. Subscribe to my channel and like this video. Is that it? And, and um, can I explain what I'm doing? Don't hit me, please. So I'm gonna be locking myself in this small Harry Potter room for the entire day. Wake up, Coco! We're going to the zoo! Jesus Christ! Coming out only to cook and eat my dookie. And prison. clean my room, cause you're a prisoner. I'm not cleaning your room. That's not. I mean. Tell a... your subscribers to subscribe to Ryan Swayze. I already did. Again, you're a prisoner. Please subscribe to Ryan Swayze. Can I go make my breakfast now? No. Okay. I'm just. Can you come get me when it's time for breakfast? No, we wake up, we have to do exercises, so boom. Ow, There's the kettle. Ow, ow, ow. <laughs> no, no, no. Oh. We have to do our morning exercises. Oh. Stretch. Ow, ow, ow. <laughs> it's not breakfast yet. Breakfast will be in two hours, so do your workout in your room and we will be back. You absolute peasant. No. <laughs> you absolute peasant. Oh, come on. Two hours later. Breakfast time. You using that as your pillow? That's all I have. There's just nothing in here. There's just a giant sriracha bottle and a on the wall. That's it. <laughs> and I love Dr. Hobbs. <laughs> this is definitely David's room. Do I have to keep this on? No. You gotta shackle me. No, yeah, I'm not da yeah, I'm not that's David that's and Dr. Hobbs. <laughs> All right, ladies and gentlemen, for the first meal of the day, we have a few options. So I found this website that basically outlines different prisons meals for the- Hold on, when then were you allowed on the internet? It was before I was locked. Oh, okay. Like I said, there's different things that they serve at different prisons. So we've got about three different prisons that we're gonna draw on for today's video. And we're gonna make a few different meals from each prison's menu. Now, one of these prisons is easily the most savage of all prisons, the breakfast. 
Lunch and dinner are like, I don't even know how you survived in this place. I get you committed a crime, but like, how are they living? Some of them, it's not as bad. So we're gonna start with the not so bad breakfast, but I'm gonna show you both of them. We're gonna make both, and then we're gonna try both, and just imagine what it would be like to eat both for breakfast. So we're gonna start off with the absolute worst breakfast that I found for any prison. We're gonna probably- One of Ryan's juice cleanses. I wish. This try it, try it. You can try that one. I can have this in prison? Yeah, have a little sip. It's pretty good, what is this? Bro, they should do that in jail, give juice Dude. cleanses. I feel like these are beans though. Yeah, that was like $9. they are trying to spend no beans, bro. Oh yeah. They get this one, average price per meal, guess. I'd say $7. Per meal? Yeah. Okay, are you ready, Swayze? On average, the meals from easily the most savage prison on this list are 58 cents a meal. How? 58 cents a meal. I'm H, save you money. Save me money on- Is it my prison? Okay, the breakfast, here's the breakfast. It's a piece of toast, half an egg or less. <laughs> one serving of unsweetened, unsalted oatmeal. That's the Ew. whole breakfast. No drinks, no juice, no coffee. Not even water. No milk, nothing, it shows nothing. I'm sure you can get water somewhere, I hope. But that's the entire breakfast, so that's what I'm gonna start my day off with. All right guys, we've got our oatmeal right here, so we just mixed it up. I got the worst name brand I could find and the cheapest of everything to make it as close to the prison food as possible. Basically, we're just gonna microwave it. We're making our hard-boiled egg, which I'm only gonna get to eat half of as well, so Put that in. And then the last part of the meal, easily the most difficult part of the meal, is a piece of bread. I will say this, it's really easy to make. It's not, it's not complicated. All right, our oatmeal is ready. Mmm, delicious, unsweetened, unflavored oatmeal. Oh. I don't get the full thing, I get about half, so. So appetizing, there's yum. Uh, two thirds of my meal. Now all we have to wait for is the half hard boiled egg, and I'm ready to eat. Yay. This is gonna be shit. A few moments later. All right, folks, we got our uh, first meal of the day. Lots of nutrients here. Lots of uh, good stuff to get you started <laughs> on the right take foot. take in this meal? A non-toasted bread, dutty oatmeal, and probably an uncooked egg because we were kind of lazy and rushed it. Oh my God! Oh my God. That's actually disgusting. All right. Oh my God. Lesson of the day, kids. Don't, don't, go don't go to jail. Don't go to jail. Don't go, do not go to jail. That's so bad, bro. I got so... Tastes like if, if like scrambled eggs were a cereal. Ew. Don't make me sick. The difficult part would be like, this is all you get. So even if it's disgusting, like you have to eat it. It's not like, oh, well my next meal is going to be blessed. <laughs> so I'll just eat blessed then. I bet you the breads get dummy. Quick. Yeah, this is bro. This is a nice bread. This is high quality nine grain. They're not getting that. Yeah, this is all we had in the house. And it's still but I bet they get the bread and go. Mm, mm, so good. Mm. <laughs> Cut up with the egg, <laughs> guys. We kind of rushed the egg, so hopefully it's cooked in the middle. Babs, baby, baby. All right, now I can only eat half. So my protein for the day? With no salt, no nothing. There you go, all my protein for the day. <laughs> yeah, you look miserable, bro. Of course. Are you sure you want to do, do the act that you did? Like, was it worth it? Do the what? Like, you know, you're in prison, so you must, you're here for a reason. So does this food make you no. <laughs> reconsider? Like, everything, besides the fact that you might get your ass beat every day in prison, you can't see anyone you love. This might be the worst part. Taking eating this every day, bro. Every day, bro. <laughs> On your Jake Paul shit. Every day. Okay, you try yours. I made Swayze a little mini plate too. Just try it. Just taste Guys, it. Guys, I'm having a little piece of each one. Bro, an uns this this is disgusting. Oh my god. Bro, isn't oatmeal supposed to be like good for you? It's good for you, yeah. But this is unflavored, unsweetened. Also Yo, you just spat in my it's food. Uneaten, bro. I can't eat that. So I it's bro. kind of a vibe, no? I could never. Every do that. day, bro. How would you feel about that? I feel worse than Jake Paul felt after every day he exists. And then the egg. Not bad. The egg's not bad. I, I like feel it. like low key we cooked it better though. In yeah. the picture they had, it was like kind of uncooked and shit. Like this is a Chef good egg. Chef Ryan actually told Sean how to cook this beautiful, nice, amazing egg. Wow. And then the bread. And you're done. There's your whole meal. <laughs> 
until lunch. Okay, so this is the worst meal that you could possibly get, all right? But they do have other prisons which, with some slight alterations. So let me get those and just show you what it could be at a slightly better prison. Ugh. So this is basically what you got. Instead of the hard boiled egg, it could be scrambled. And then you would also get a little bit of mixed fruit us. Okay, that's a bad. Show that you know that is a generous helping. You would maybe get three yeah. of those things. <laughs> yeah, this is okay. nice. That's that's way more than you get. You get some orange juice. Not yeah, not. Mean, that's the juice. max amount of orange juice you get. You get some milk. Okay, I'm not gonna have that because the if milk. you have orange juice and milk, you'll barf. Uh, so milk and and. A little bit of coffee if you if you like coffee. I don't like coffee. I'm so a, how much better guy. would you say this is compared to the one I just gave you? I like, honestly say it is way better. This one is, would be way better because you get a little fruit, you get a little taste. The other one was honestly disgusting. Knowing I won't be able to eat until lunch is the probably the worst part. <laughs> like, the food's not horrible other than this nasty ass oatmeal. So you mean knowing that you're doing like a 24 hour prison food challenge and like you're not gonna get to eat anything else till lunch like me and you, you'd be cheesy. Yeah, cause me, me and Chad are about to go to a nice ass restaurant while Sean eats this shitty ass food. But it's for your entertainment guys, this is only breakfast, we got a bunch more to go. Man, yeah, let's get a pop give, me, give me my milk, you know? Yeah, you can have all this I shit. I can have my milk, a little one, two grapes and of, shit. Oh, no, I want the grapes, you can have Oh, I want one grape. I'm in prison, you give me a grape. Yeah, you can have this weird lemon shit. No one eats that. On a scale of one to 10, as to how satisfied I feel after my breakfast and ready to take on a day, I would have to give myself a solid 2.5. I feel like I got zero nutrients besides the little bit of milk I just had at the end and a single grape. Everything else didn't feel like anything, but that's the life that I'm leading. But that's what I have to deal with today, and that was just breakfast. Lunch um, doesn't get much better, so I guess. Yeah, I'm yeah, yeah, yeah. Hero, get back in yourself. Please. I'm not holding your hands, buddy. I'm not. I'm doing it myself. Yeah. Get down there, buddy. I'm simulating. Yeah, yeah. Shut up. Tell him to the judge. Hey, come give me a lunch. Tell him to the judge. Come give me Talk to the judge. Be the judge. You love the judge. Three hours later. All right, guys, it's your boy Swayze Baby here. Sean's in his prison cell, and he told me what to make, but you know your boy's hungry. He's a prisoner. He doesn't get options. So this is the lunch portion of his day, I think. He's supposed to get 17 Doritos, but as I mentioned before, your boy's starving. Also, we got more bread, just like, just like breakfast, but with the bread, you get good old bologna. But not regular, any old bologna. You get one slice of bologna. We're living luxury. He's actually gonna get two sandwiches with one piece of bologna in them. And I'm probably like, five burritos, cause your boys are. Does he even need five? I'll just get. But anyways, let's go get Sean and feed him the shitty ass food. There you go. Mr. Callahan. Mr. Callahan. Yes. Lunch is served. I don't even get to come upstairs for it? Nope. You only get <laughs> breakfast and dinner privileges. Lunch is. This guy's rocking Gucci slides in my head while I'm in prison. What kind of prison guard are you? A All fashionable right. one. What do I get? You get two bologna sandwiches. I told you I was supposed to get chips with it. <laughs> you did get chips. I got a chip. There's one chip. <laughs> I was hungry, bro. Did you show them that, like, you show them what it was supposed to be? Yes. But then I got a little hungry, and now you get a chip. This is prisoner abuse, my Prisoners dude. don't have, like, rights, my... <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, my God. <laughs> Luckily, we gave you two bologna sandwiches. <laughs> and a fart. <laughs> Bro, I'm, like, stuck in a room. You just popped in the room. Like, I'm stuck in it. I hate bologna, bro. Can you even taste it? It's just all crust. I haven't had bologna in so long. I'm down to try it, actually. <laughs> Pretty bad. Every day? <laughs> Every day. You're not bringing back childhood memories, bro? I hated bologna as a kid. <laughs> How's the chip, though? The chips are vibes. This feels like the lunch that, like, a kid going to grade three would have and be aged at, but, like, it's so bad for you. Like, you need more than this. Like, <laughs> you can't tell me that you can survive on this. That's why you gotta beat up the other prisoners to get the food. Oh, I bet that's why. They beat they fight, bro. They snuff them and teeth their shit. I bet you there's bear prisoners, like the pinch ones, that literally get no food. Mm hmm So how you feeling? Like really excited for tomorrow. When you have when you eat the exact same things. No, when I'm not a prisoner for twenty four hours <laughs> anymore. <anyway. laughs> right, I'm gonna finish eating this, I guess, and see you in what time is this? Twelve? Yeah. When do I get dinner? Nine. 
Nine? Okay, I'm joking. Dinner is usually served around six, but you will be allowed out at six. Okay. So six I'll, I'll slide it under the. the Maybe six thirty. Can you like kind of take this seriously? Like I'm actually doing this, please. <laughs> okay, I'll finish this. I'm gonna slide it under the door too when I'm done, so I can't leave. And I'll see you guys in like five hours. Um. <laughs> what is that? My phone. There's no cell phones in prison. Okay, well, I'm not actually in No, prison. bro, if you're doing the challenge, hand it over. You're doing the challenge, you have to do it fully. What? <laughs> Come on. Come on. <laughs> no, you have to do the challenge. You have to do the challenge full blown, bro. This is serious talks. You're gonna think prisoners are allowed to just eat not like just not eat and shit? Are you busting up my food? You don't even make sense. <laughs> We're gonna take Sean's phone and we'll see y'all at six. A few moments later. Hi right, guys, um I finished eating my meal. Actually, I didn't finish eating it. That's a lie. I couldn't finish eating it. I mean, I do know tomorrow that I can eat like a regular human, so I just couldn't force myself to eat all the bologna and bread that was right there. But I am seriously getting really, really hungry, and I think my final meal of the day is gonna be a little bit better. Swayze was nice enough to let me use my camera to vlog my experience a little bit for you guys. So here's a quick room tour, or cell tour, I guess, since that's what we're doing today. All right, I'm done with the room tour. I hope you guys enjoyed it. But yeah, I'm going on about like four hours, five hours in here. It's It was a lot easier when I had my phone because I was just watching Twitch the whole time. But now I have nothing to do besides vlog. So yeah, guess I just have five more hours to go. So I'm gonna sleep for a bit and hopefully if I'm able to sleep for like five hours, then I'll wake up and have my meal, which will be blessed. And then I'll try and sleep again, I guess. I don't know how much sleeping I can really do. Every time the guys walk up and down the stairs, it's so loud. <sighs> Safe to say this is pretty old, so I'm just gonna sleep. You guys can watch me sleep for a bit because I don't know what the hell else to do. At least this blanket's pretty comfy. I'm starting to get why prisoners work out a lot. Cause like, what the hell else are you gonna do? Do some push-ups, I guess. Like, what What am I supposed to do? Well, needless to say, kids, don't go to jail. I don't even know what to film. That's how, like, this is so boringly oaf for me. I don't even know what to film for you guys. So I'm just gonna chill, I guess, until Ryan comes to get me for my next meal and final meal of the day. <laughs> this is out. Three hours later. <laughs> What's up, maggot? You just gotta be so rude. You haven't, you, guys, you haven't had a text in hours. I don't even know why I took that from you. Your phone drier than the Sahara Desert. That's a little frazzle. You haven't had a text in hours. Me. No. Okay, okay. Is it dinner time yet? Please, please. Fam. What? Where the hell did you get that sweater? Oh, this little thing. You know. <laughs> <laughs> when did you change? I did. When? I did. Don't worry about it. Who's giving you clothes in jail? I escaped prison for a short period of time. And I have a big announcement to make for the people at home. I escaped prison just for this announcement. As you guys can see, this is the pink version of the hoodie. We got the merch coming very soon on January 31st. Market what are you account. doing? What, you can't promo your merch in jail. You cannot sell sell merch in jail. What's going on, man? I'm just I'm just trying to let the people know when the merch drops. That's what what's the date? January 31st. It's dropping. You'll be out by then. But anyways, yeah, all right. Tell them. Tell them what's going on. You have three seconds. Go. The, the merch is dropping. That's all. That's all right. All. Perfect. Let's go. Let's go eat. eat. All right, folks. It is the final meal of the day, if you can even call these meals, because I think that's seriously debatable. But this is the worst prison meal. Right here, here's a picture. So it's hot dogs, a couple little onions, piece of bread, and some beans. Super nutritious, really excited for that one. And then here is the good version, which has some little vegetables, a little potatoes, a little mini pasta, something to actually eat. Still not very exciting, but at least it's something. So I'm gonna make both of those and then finally complete our day of eating like a prisoner for 24 hours. All right, so for the first meal, we've got a, a very complicated one. We've got some uh, beans, two hot dogs. That's and a vibe. You ever had a raw hot dog? Never in my life. If you eat that raw right now, I'm gonna fucking vomit. 
Facts. You're disgusting. You're actually ew, ew, ew. This one's kind of like low budget since it's great value, but I tried to get like the worst budget for mm -hmm. this video. You actually used to just eat raw hot dogs? Yeah, it's a bat. When you raise them. Comment down below. When you raise them in a poor family. Shh. You're, you're used to certain things that a lot of people. The hot dogs, the bread. Oh. <coughs> That's actually so and nasty. And the beans. Look, I know in the UK, oh, eating beans is like a common thing. No. But I have never in my life just eaten straight beans. Ever. Like this. Never, never. Well, maybe once or twice. I had time. beans once. Okay, I had beans in my burrito. Once, once. Once. Bro, smell. Oh, I couldn't, smell, I couldn't actually. Smell, 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 I, smell, no, smell. no. We're making these all the worst way possible, just microwaving it. Like, Hot dogs are a vibe. Like if you cook them on a pan, you pan fry them, they're actually wavy. But we're gonna microwave them, we're gonna microwave the beans. We're gonna have this delicious, scrumptious, nutritious dinner. So this is our meal. Um, vibes. Literally, has there been a single fruit or vegetable in this whole thing? Like from these three meals? We had the fruits, we had the fruits in the morning. But that wasn't part of this person's meal. Like if you were in this prison, you weren't Oh yeah, that. no, this prison is absolutely rude. This prison's insane. Okay, so at least you get a little bread so you could do one of these. <laughs> so now we were up to six loaves of bread with this prison. Yeah, I don't think they even give Ooh, you ketchup. Oh, that's a vibe. It's just No ketchup. Like... It's not bad. It's not bad. But it's not, it's definitely not good. Like, I'm interested in you in trying that because that looks absolutely disgusting. <laughs> See, bro, you're dying on the inside. This guy farted. That was disgusting, bro. I know, that's gross. How could you, you know, that shows you how le little nutrients are in this. Sean's farting up the storm. It's nasty. Like the, they can tell the sound came from that direction. <laughs> what direction? Crazy. Anyways. That's absolutely disgusting. <laughs> I ate one bean. You're not a bean yet, what? <laughs> if you eat beans raw, you're a bean. You're a fucking bean. You're a bean, you're a bean, I can't. <laughs> you might them. have to cook them and shit, like. I did, I put them in the microwave. The dookie, okay, maybe they're better if you cook them like regularly, but cooking them in the microwave, and if you eat beans that you cook from the microwave, holy hell on earth. <laughs> oh my, this looks like what I imagined prison would look like. Like this right here. A didn't your didn't your brother go to prison for a couple years? I don't have a brother. Yeah, because he's in prison. No, oh, you don't you don't mention him. Okay, never mind. Continue. continue. <laughs> okay, here we go. You didn't spit it out yet. It's like the hot dog and the bread is mashing the beans. That's a vibe. Like I'm really curious as to whether or not or how long it would take until you got used to this. What do you think? How many days in till you got used to this? Three weeks. Three weeks and then you'd be Three like- Three weeks to make a habit. So a habit of eating dutty disgusting Dusty, food. it would just be like, it is what it is. It is what it is. Your taste buds would acclimate. <sighs> well, that was a lovely dinner. Um, <laughs> I thoroughly enjoyed this meal. Now let's try and make our slightly better but still disgusting uh, part two of prison dinner. And we have our final meal of the day, the slightly better version. Yo, bro, you gotta stop all meal buttons. There you go. You think they give a fuck in prison? They don't care. We've got our mashed potatoes, we've got a little bit of veggies, we've got some apple slices. Now, I will point out, I got the worst, most dookiest versions of everything I possibly could. So the mashed potatoes are actually from a Hungry Man frozen dinner that I scooped out. Same with the vegetables. And then we've got the great value frozen uh, pasta, which is this going is to be- This is not horrible. This is by far the best meal. Easily, easily, easily. But oh take in, God. this is what you still eat every day. Like you don't, like, like because of what we just ate, this actually looks vabs. But in reality, this is oaf. <laughs> but at least you old. have all the different food groups. Whereas the other ones you didn't, you got nothing. All right. Um, I'm gonna start with the apple. Mm, apple blast. <laughs> that was amazing. Apple is just apple. Apparently, really up an apple. It's actually so good. This is the best thing I've eaten all day. Actually, some nutrients today. I'm definitely most scared about the mashed potatoes. Look at these. They don't look. Oh my. When it doesn't disconnect, that's kind of fuck? disgusting. I don't think it would be too bad. Try it. I'm it, worried about the dirty seasoned vegetables. Those look disgusting. It looks like what I imagine air would look like if it was made into food format. <laughs> there is zero nutrients zero, in there. Zero, zero, zero. You're eating nothing. <laughs> it tastes like absolutely nothing. No salt, no pepper. Oh my God. Wow, that's so bad. That's easily the worst mashed potatoes I ever had in my life. No! I can't imagine eating that every day. All right, we'll try the, uh, the veggies. Those look disgusting. 
The veggies aren't bad. Really? They're just like Ugh. shitty frozen steamed veggies. But like, I could, I could eat these. This is, I just want to say this is a lot better. Way better. The apple is a huge vibe. These are really bad, but I'm really hungry because I haven't eaten anything today. Um, but yeah, now let's, let's try out this little bit of pasta. That doesn't look too bad. It's not bad. It's pretty, it's decently, the, I will say the one thing is, these are just super salty. Like they put oh, a lot of salt oh, on it. Oh, that's disgusting. I feel like it makes up for the lack of flavor, but it's like, clearly these are not good for you at all. Okay, you try it. No, thank you. Just try it. No, thanks. I'll stick, I'm about to cook, guys, you see, I'm about to cook some tacos. Sean is absolutely stressed. I'm not, I'm, I'm not eating that shit. I got that. Just try the potatoes. Potatoes? Uh, my family's actually potato farmers, so. And? Not bad. Try the veggies, just a little bit. No, I'll only eat the corn. It's not bad. That's disgusting. Okay, now the pasta. You make me eat everything. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, hella salty. Oh my God. Could you eat this every day? No chance in hell. No chance? But it's still not, like compared to the hot dog, it's not bad. Like, growing up, like I lived in like a very unprivileged. I'm just I'm turning up. Nope. Like a very unprivileged home. Letting, no, so I no, like I'm, I'm used to like dirty like I could eat this because I'm really. Your super mom hard. is watching this cheesed at you. I've been to your house. The food she made. My was My mom's delicious. watching this cheese. She's cheese. The food yeah, she made was so I good. I wish she could afford cheese when I was growing up. <laughs> what? <laughs> oh. <laughs> His mom is a great cook. I just want to say, Marlene, if you're watching this, phenomenal chef. I really loved all the meals you've made us at your house. The ones we could afford. But anyways, guys, yeah. The apple is a bad. This is disgusting. This is disgusting because it reminds me of okay, the hard I'm times just, that right. I had. Well, you want to try some potatoes? <laughs> First of all, I see some greens, beans, potatoes, no tomatoes. <laughs> no ham. You need some ham. Yeah. Just take in, this is the good dinner. There was a prison where all you got was hot dog, beans, and two slices of bread. It's kind of a vibe, no? Yeah, yeah the mashed potatoes could be worse. That? It could be worse. Oh, really? The mashed potatoes could be worse. The vegetables taste like frozen vegetables. Yeah, they like, are. Like what? Like whatever from yeah, like yeah, yeah. bottom grade frozen. <laughs> not Mr. Green or the green. No, yeah. Guy. Like do keep frozen. Green giant. Vegetables. No, no, none no, of no. that. This is great value at best. Did you try the pasta? I'm not trying. The pasta. <laughs> Okay, so clearly I think I enjoyed that final meal a little bit more than everybody else, probably because I've eaten nothing all day and it was all so trash that this actually was a little bit better. But that is gonna be it for the 24 hours eating prison food. Yo, Chad, you want some fajitas in Bongo? Fajitas? Yeah. Wait, you mean instead of jail foods for the rest of the day? Yeah, yeah, that, no, that's Sean's challenge. I didn't do shit. That shit's garbage, bro. I would never do that shit. That looks like shit, dog. I'm eating fucking fajitas, my guy. Oh, oh, my, oh, you're filming still. My bad. I hope you guys enjoyed the video because obviously I did it. I think Ryan did though. He just got to torture me all day. So if you guys want to see more 24 hours eating challenges, be sure to let me know by, by smashing the thumbs up button. Comment any ideas you have down below and um, don't commit crimes. If for no other reason than the food is absolute shit. That's, that is so more Chad, than you want reason. one fajita or two fajitas? Yo, give, me, yo, give me three though. Three? Okay, how about you, Bongo? Ah! Uh... As always, thank you guys so much for watching, and I will catch you next time. Toodles! And of course, almost forgot, I gotta give a huge shout out again to Legendary Game of Heroes for sponsoring the video. Be sure to check out the link at the top of the description to download the app. Oh, <laughs>